royal wedding guests were offered slippers to give their well-heeled feet a rest after a long ceremony at Windsor Castle's St. George Chapel on Saturday. Pretty Little Liars actress Troy and Belisario showed off the comfy white slippers on her Instagram story following the wedding of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. How amazing is this because these shoes have come off, Belisario, 32, said on her story while holding her high-heeled shoes. They have slip ears for us, slippers. I'm so ready. As she approached a gentleman handing out the slippers, he could be heard asking the actress if she would like a pair. Yes, please, she is heard saying. Providing slippers or flip-flops has become a common and welcome touch in many American weddings and now, it seems, royal weddings too. Meghan and Harry added a lot of personal touches to their wedding to make the royal affair far more personal. The couple all also gave out goodie bags to mark the special day. Aside from celebrating the slippers on social media, Belisario sent her well wishes to Meghan and Harry on Instagram, writing in the caption, Weddings are a joyous occasion. But today was just off the charts amazing. Congratulations Meghan and Harry. I am so grateful I got to witness your love today. There are many happy years to come. Also, thank you so much at Annabella Harron at Temperley London for making me feel so beautiful on such a momentous occasion, she continued. And last but definitely not least, thank you at Half Adams for being your devastatingly handsome self and letting me come along for the ride. Related, Meghan Markle honors Princess Diana by wearing her aquamarine ring for wedding reception Belisario, who attended the wedding with husband and Meghan Suits co-star Patrick J. Adams, also shared a gif of her slippered feet alongside those of Suits actress Sarah Rafferty and actress Abigail Spencer, both close friends of the bride. On Thursday, Adams and Belisario shared photos of their adventure in London ahead of the royal wedding. The 36-year-old Canadian actor, who played Meghan's on-screen husband on USA Network's hit legal drama, shared photos from his trip to the UK via his Instagram account. The two enjoyed themselves at the Royal Standard of England, a 900-year-old alehouse that they made to celebrate a friend's birthday. The couple joined other Suits stars at St. George Chapel, including Rick Hoffman, Gina Torres, Gabriel Macht and Rafferty. Meghan and Harry said I do in front of 600 guests on Saturday, including Queen Elizabeth, Prince Philip, Prince Charles, Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, Prince William and Kate Middleton. Charles had a special role in the service, escorting Meghan down the aisle after it was confirmed that her father, Thomas Markle, couldn't attend the wedding. Related, the sweet way Prince Harry and Meghan Markle honoured Princess Diana during their royal wedding The new Duchess of Sus wore a stunning Givenchy wedding dress designed by Claire Waite Keller who created the gown out of pure white silk with an open neckline and slight A-line skirt. Can't get enough of People's Royals coverage? Sign up for our newsletter to get the latest updates on Kate Middleton, Meghan Markle and more. For her wedding reception, the former actress stepped out in a custom white bespoke lily high neck gown made of silk crepe by Stella McCartney. The dress featured a high halter neck with an open back and a train that Meghan carried as she walked to a silver blue Jaguar that Harry drove. She accessorized her look with a pair of heels from one of her favorite footwear brands, Aquazora, that are made in silky satin, with nude mesh, with soles painted in baby blue, according to the palace. She also wore a pair of diamond drop earrings and showed off an emerald-cut aquamarine ring that once belonged to the late Princess Diana.